Hi everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. So I've just made it out today over to uh, Danbury Common and um, unfortunately this week I've been really restricted on the uh, time that I've been able to get out. So I've only literally got one hour and if I'm able to capture one composition within that one hour, it'd be a plus. And I think that's hopefully what my aim of uh, today is, is to challenge myself to get, capture one image in one hour and subsequently try and put a uh, vlog together as well. Let's have a go. So the conditions today are really quite challenging. I've got very strong sunlight coming through and even though it's still sort of middle of February, it's uh, creating quite harsh light on the actual, uh, any detail in the actual um, sort of vistas that I'm seeing. So I think what I need to think along the lines of, and I've taken a couple of shots already, is, is going more for detailed images. Um, coming to the woods can be very, very challenging as a, as a photographic location. There's a lot of chaos and trying to sort of get some simplicity is, is very very difficult and I think today rather than going for sort of the grander wider images that, that I have sort of captured in the past kind of looking a little bit more detailed a little bit more interesting at some of the bark and the texture on some of the trees and, and some of the uh, obviously items on the ground as well will hopefully work out to be a little bit more interesting. <laughs> camera set up here um, in manual mode um, ISO uh, 100 about aperture of about f4.8 
to f3.5 uh, and just uh, looking at some of the detail here on the actual uh, tree stump and uh, some of the bark and having the light side and the darker side and that sort of contrast of the two working out quite well I feel. A couple of um, shots I've taken, I've obviously zoomed in so I've got the 18 to 135 lens on and that's actually looking at quite quite interesting both detailed images and then obviously looking up to the tree and getting that sort of bit of distortion effect on the actual uh, lens as well so hopefully working out to be a couple of good images. If any of them do work out well then I'll uh, post the uh, details of each setting that I took for that image. So today's conditions are really not necessarily conducive with photography and um, also being up against it, against the clock, as I said, only having an hour is really not long enough. But unfortunately that's the time that I was only able to get this week to actually get out with a camera. Looking on the positive side of things, that is what I've actually been able to do, is get out with my camera rather than not. And, and that's you've got to take the positives out of the negatives really. Um, trying to get some of the images as well, working with the conditions at the same time. Um, as I mentioned, it's really quite challenging in, in the woodlands uh, to actually get any absolute amazing images. Unfortunately the weather conditions, the time of day that I'm here today, it, it's, it's probably not necessarily conducive. If I, was, if I was able to get here maybe um, earlier in the morning or in the evening, that, that may well be produced uh, a better quality of Im images or more variety of images that I would have been able to capture. However, that's not the case. But um, yeah, it, it worked out okay. I think I've got probably one, maybe two images that I'm quite interested in um, and uh, hopefully will be working out okay. But uh, yeah, just, just one of those things. That ultimately, at the end of the day, what's most important is the fact I've been able to get out with a camera and take several images. But uh, thanks a lot for watching, if you have persevered with it so far. If you have, please make sure you give it a thumbs up and also drop us a comment as well, as I do like those comments and obviously that uh, verbal interaction after uh, my videos as well. But uh, if you have enjoyed it as well, please consider subscribing, as that really does help me to motivate myself to get out to produce these images and these content as well. But uh, thanks a lot for watching and take care.